Hello everyone, thanks for tuning in. This is a quick video showing you guys a project that I've been working on. It's two light guns built completely from scratch using MDF wood. This one is a Bluetooth version using the Ultimark Bluetooth module. On the back, I have the button for your right click slash reload. On the bottom, I have a USB port. This USB port is only for charging the internal battery. And this opening is for a switch to turn the power off if I ever need to turn it off. But normally it just goes to sleep and you squeeze the trigger to wake it up. This is the camera in the front. Uh, eventually I'll put an IR filter uh, lens on the front, but right now it works just fine without that filter. Here's what the inside of that Bluetooth gun looks like. If you're interested in building something similar to this, in the description I did went ahead and post um, the Ultimark Bluetooth module that I used. This is the next gun that I'm working on. This one is going to be a gun for IR build. The camera has been on back order for a long time, but on the back here I have a 16 millimeter button and above that I have a mode button for switching between different modes. Uh, on the bottom, USB port. I did went ahead and drill the 16 millimeter hole in the front for the camera whenever it does arrive. I initially wanted this gun for IR build to be a Bluetooth version, but I was told that the Bluetooth module is pretty laggy. So I went ahead and uh, chose to just make it a wired. I do have a rumble motor inside of here. It's pretty small and uh, mounted inside of the wood. But I'll go ahead and show you guys a quick uh, gameplay uh, playing Mad Bullets with the Bluetooth Ultimark light gun build. There are a few different ways to reload in this game. My preferred way is to use the button on the back of the gun. Uh, I could also shoot off screen to reload or shoot the ammo belt in the bottom left hand corner of the screen. After I receive the camera for the gun for IR build and complete that build, I might make another video to show you guys what that finished product looks like and how well it works. Um, I'm sure you could find other videos on YouTube that uh, shows you how well the gun for IR works, um, which is part of the reason why I'm doing that build. But the main reason is because I do also have a sending light gun and I notice whenever I'm playing uh, certain games, we're using the sending light gun on my computer because of the extra work that my computer is doing to put the barter up and uh, run the program for the gun, um, some games run pretty slow uh, due to that program running in the background. So that's why I'm going with the gun for IR build here. Uh, but thank you guys for watching. And like I say, once I finish the next build, I might post a video to show you guys what it looks like.